car viewers. This is the open DC motor. I had to help some of my kids out with a uh, little project at school. This little project involves chemical energy, magnetic energy, kinetic energy, noise and warmth, heat. This armature comes out of a little uh, hedge trimmer. It runs quite nice actually. I made up the commutator contacts myself from a couple of copper strips. The emitter fluctuates a little bit as the contacts are not perfect. Interesting thing was observed by holding the coal nearby, you can get an LED to glow on the field fluctuation of the motor. Stop the motor. So that the coil picks up the magnetic flux from the actual motor, which is quite cool. Used to be wired up power in for one call, out of one call, into the second call, to the windings and back out, and then to the armature. So I'm not using this piece. I'm just going to run on 24 volts. Take a couple of high. So get good flux. So this is the open DC motor with permanent magnet. 24 volts, a bit more arcing is visible. Okay. You want my motor starts? And run up to 24. The permanent DC motor. Good school pro project for kids at uh, high school or intermediate. From all parts. Audio on the speaker. Can we go to Crumb Park after? Yeah, we can, Jacob. Let's look at the motor. I'm going to have to get in here. Come on. Show me the kitty get. Oh, you're not in the camera. Can we? There you are. Cool. Kitty Kit and Jacob studying this device. Thanks for watching. Okay, you're probably wondering why the speaker was on this as well. Part of the exercise was to make audio with the speaker, which I can take from the commutator bars. Listen. It's a speaker on DC. The DC permanent magnet motor, power source 12 volt battery, the homemade uh, contacts for the commutators, armature and the magnet, permanent magnet, whether it's north or south pole doesn't matter, and an air meter can be fitted optional. Credit of this design also has to go to Robert 33 he is one of my Italian friends who made up a similar motor also on a display to show how an uh, Free armature can be driven from a 12 volt source. Do another one with the inductance. I've got a little small transformer here with an LED. The blue LED. Can I fix it up properly? I pick up the magnetic flux from the armature of the motor, so there's no connection as such. 
was completely free. And this was the red LED which we used outside. Be very bright. This is completely clear of the motor. Very cool. And that's it, and I'm going to put it on YouTube. Anybody from schools, uh, teachers, and so on, they're more than welcome to copy this video and use it for uh, their class training.